frequently asked question number eight, how do we move the mark on the graphs if for some reason it's not exactly where the graph should be? So we just ran a test, and here's the actual results of the test. The markers, as you could see, actually fell exactly in line with where they should. Where the first, where the curve starts over the axis, and then where it was at the bottom. But what we did was we actually moved the line. The way we did that was we moved, we pressed fire, and then we took the line, and we moved it and clicked right back on the spot of where it should be. If we wanted to move the pre-fire, we click on pre-fire, and we can move that line exactly wherever it needs to be. But we're gonna, for this particular exercise, we're gonna put it back. Now this is exactly where the lines should be. One right on the axis of where the curve crosses, and then the fire is right at the absolute bottom of the bell curve of where it came down. So let's say we perform a test and the graph is not marked or it doesn't come down the axis where our marking system doesn't exactly go to the bottom of it. So simply what you do is you could just take a business card or a credit card and you just line it up as the curve is coming down, you hit on the fire button, and then you simply then could move the line exactly to where the bottom of where your bell curve happened. Now, you can see that we've lined up this particular line, the fire, exactly to the bottom of where the bell curve is. That's how you correctly mark a graph if you need to mark a graph.